Well, a six-year-old girl from Pemberville is about to get not one, but two gifts of a lifetime. That's right. These custom-built walkers designed by two teams of engineering students at the University of Toledo. 13 ABC's Tony Geptis is live with a story you'll only see on 13 ABC. And quite a story it is, Tony. Absolutely, Lee and Diane. It is a very unique situation where these walkers will be a final grade for a handful of UT students here. And it will also be a special gift that can go to very good use for one little girl. This is so okay. great. Okay. Bethany Rasmussen is taking her new walkers for a test run. Oh, this is awesome. Bethany, who's six years old, weighs 23 pounds. She has a rare genetic condition called wolf Hirschhorn syndrome. I always say she may be small, but she's just such a big blessing. Bethany's mom, Kelly, explains her youngest daughter is nonverbal, but you can tell she's overjoyed by her newfound mobility. It's been really difficult for us to find a walker for her that um, gives her the freedom that she wants. Um, because of her small size, most of the equipment out there is just so heavy. Um, it makes it really difficult for her to, to maneuver it. That's where these University of Toledo students come in. They're studying mechanical engineering, and as a final project, they're custom building walkers for Bethany. It was proposed as just an indoor walker project, but there was such an outreach of the students wanting to do that one singular project that they created two groups, one to create an indoor walker and one to create an outdoor walker. Today, Bethany got to try out the walkers for the first time. We've been working on this for now 13, 14 weeks, and so this is the first time that we, we finally see Bethany in the product, and it's definitely motivating. The most important thing for us is that Bethany's safe with whatever she's doing, wherever she's walking. Bethany's father, Kurt, gave the students some feedback. For the next week, they'll be working to tweak their designs. We're going to be adjusting the wheels and adjusting the leg setup to almost a stair step down, so there is no tipping hazard. Then they'll present their final projects during the College of Engineering Senior Design Expo Friday, April 29th from noon until 3 at Nitschke Hall. After that, Bethany can take the walkers home. It's just been such a huge blessing. This, this will open up so much freedom for her. Freedom to be a kid. Those walkers will be among the 60 projects presented here at Nitschke Hall. Again, one week from tomorrow, it is free and open to everyone if you'd like to come out and see them yourself. For now, reporting live at UT, Tony Geftis, 13ABC Action News.